Hi everyone, Louis here and today I'm going to be making a quick video on how you can change your YouTube layout back to the older version of the layout. I don't normally make videos on things like this but I've noticed a big difference in views on my videos recently and I've noticed a similar theme in other YouTubers and heard it from other YouTubers as well because the new subscriptions on the new YouTube layout is really really bad unless you know how to actually go on to the older version of the subscriptions on the new layout which is kind of a messy process. Um, you're going to be missing a lot of subscriptions from all of your favourite YouTubers you know. If you've subscribed to someone, you probably do want to see their videos rather than random people's videos. So, to make this work, you are going to have to use Chrome. I'm not sure if there's any fix right now out for Firefox, but, you know, most people probably do use Chrome. Maybe you're 50% compared to Firefox. So, just open up Chrome, and once you've done that, just go ahead and go to YouTube.com. Just to show you guys quickly what the problem with, the uh, you know, the new YouTube layout is, you can see... It's not so much a problem on this resolution because I'm recording this at a low resolution, but most people will be using a high resolution and you'll see the entire page is left aligned. All of the right uh, area of the page is completely blank, which just sucks and there's no point of it. And you'll also notice you'll see, you know, like this, um, uploaded two days ago. I don't know why I'd want to see something two days ago, five days ago, four days ago. It's just... It doesn't really make any sense. Like this, 20 hours ago was posted. I could post, for example, on my YouTube channel, you know, I'm going to be streaming right now. Here's the link. And people will see that 20 hours after it's happened. It just doesn't make any sense. So you can also click on this and then click on this over here. And this is kind of how the original subscriptions did work. But to be honest, most people probably don't know how to do that. And most people will have this as your favorite. As you can see right here, I've got that as my favorite. So... It just doesn't really make any sense. I don't know why it's happened, but I'm just going to show you guys how to fix that. So let's get straight into it. So this will be in the description below. Just go ahead and copy all of this. Make sure you don't copy, you know, too little or too much. Otherwise, it will cause some issues. Then press Control, Shift, and J, and make sure you are on the YouTube page. And then just right-click and click Clear Console. Then Control v and press Enter. And it's as simple as that. You can then just F5 a page or click on the Refresh button. And magically, there you go. After you've done that, you probably want to click on this button here and change it to everything. So then you see literally everything you subscribe to, which is... I don't know, it's something which a lot of people would want, but for some reason YouTube have changed it, so you see random videos which you probably don't care about. If you do really want to change your layer back to the newer one, then just click on this, then Settings. Click on Show Advanced Settings and click on, I think it's this one here. Yeah, and then Delete Cookies and click on Clear Browsing Data and then you can F5 that and you'll see it's back to the old one. And again, you can change it. Just press Control, Shift and J. Right click Clear Console, paste it back in and enter. And there you go once again. It should have changed. So this should work on Mac as well. I'm not 100% sure about that, but I think from what I've heard, it does work on Mac as well. So yeah. It's as simple as that. I didn't make the original tutorial for this video, so if you want to see the original guy who made the video, I will have a link to his YouTube channel in the description below, so thanks a lot to him. I'd recommend sharing this technique with anyone who you think cares about YouTube. I'm sure there's lots of people out there who do actually want to see the subscriptions rather than just some random videos. Like I said before, it is a big problem for YouTubers such as myself, and essentially the new layout simply allows people to see more videos they don't care about and less videos they do care about, aka their subscriptions. There'll be a step-by-step -step guide in the description below if you did have any problems. If you've got any other questions, feel free to leave in the comment section below. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff if you did find the video useful or informative. Like I said, share it with anyone who you think might care about this, and I'll see you guys next time.